Hey, what's going on YouTube? Jeff here. And today we're gonna to be checking out Saban's Power Rangers Lightning Collections, Beast Morphers, Gold Rangers by Hasbro. So we're gonna take them off this stand here and check them out. Alrighty, so here is the Gold Ranger from Power Rangers Beast Morphers. So let's take a closer look at them. Very nicely detailed, great face sculpt, a great likeness to the actor. Great paint apps. I love the color combination of the black and gold and the silver. Nice detail on the armor. Detail on the buckle here. Very nice. So let's go over the articulation. So the head can move left and right. The head can move up and look down. The arms can come out this far. The arms can move 360. There is a bend at the elbow, a swivel at the wrist. There is also a hinge in the hand. The torso can Move back this far, forward this far. There can kick the leg can kick out this far forward. There is a bend at the elbow. I mean excuse me, the bend at the knee. There is a thigh swivel. There is a boot swivel. There is a hinge at the foot here. But due to the sculpt of the foot here, it's not able to move, but there is a foot swoop on pivot. Very nice figure here. So now we're gonna look at the accessories that this figure comes with. So here is the helmet of the Gold Ranger here. Very nicely detailed. The design reminds me a lot of the show Beetleborgs. I believe it came out during the 90s, I believe. And the design of the Gold Ranger reminds me a lot of the Beetleborg show, the Beetleborgs. I really like this design. Very nice. He also comes with the Beast Saber. Again, nicely detailed, good paint apps. He also comes with his blaster, also his morpher. Very nice. He also comes with two exchangeable hands, one closed fist, and one to hold his morpher and blaster. And he also includes a effect, a blast effect or a source lasting effect. Very nicely detailed, great sculpt. It's like a um, translucent blue. Very nice. So the head here is um, removable, so you can swap if you want him with his helmet or without. You just simply pull, I'm doing it off the camera here. You can take the head off, the head sculpt. There is a ball hinge here and you just line it up here and just attach like so. There you go. Now he's fully morphed. I really enjoy this figure. It's very nice. I highly recommend it if you're a Beast Morphers fan or Power Ranger fan or a figure collector. Very nicely detailed. Great articulation. He's great. I would rate this figure a 9 out of 10. I highly recommend it. And I hope you enjoyed this figure review. I will provide pictures at the end of the video. And I hope you all are doing well and stay safe. And I will see you all in the next one. Jeff out.